Yeah, it's so great to see you all and to be here in Goa and this is also like my first open meeting in Goa for <laughs> I think nearly two years now which is so great to be back and to see how it's just totally <laughs> totally impressive this centre is and how much it gets um, uh, more and more exalted on a day-to-day -day basis really. Everything that you see here is done by by just people dedicating their time uh, freely and it's just such a, an incredible demonstration of beneficial potency. And uh, so, so if we want to find out what beneficial potency is, uh, it, it's perfect to just, uh, just to hang out really, just to hang out and come to know all of the different descriptions that are arising in our body, the thoughts, the emotions and, sens and the sensations. We just title them data, really, just to package them nicely for you. And then we see that throughout our day, there's thoughts and emotions and sensations are constantly occurring, right? Whatever you, are, you have going on in your chair right now, that's the next thought, the next emotion, the next sensation, um, pleasantly arising or maybe not so pleasantly arising. And, and so this is what we, we just really uh, can see in our own experience. Look at your own experience now. What, what is going on right now? When looking at directly at my experience, sure, there are data, thoughts, emotions and sensations. But they rise and they, they uh, recede naturally, effortlessly. Now, open intelligence, to really know open intelligence, to directly experience open intelligence right now, stop thinking. And look again at your experience, what remains. When we stop thinking and we look at our experience, or we don't look at our experience, we naturally continue to experience, right? There's this always on knowing, this always on power. <clears throat> so what, again, whatever thoughts, emotions and sensations are arising there in your chair or wherever you are in the world right now, in the multiverse, there's this all pervasive presence, open intelligence. Open intelligence is, is just all pervasive, like, like light naturally pervades space, all of space. How effortless does light pervade space? That's how effortlessly you are free, free to openly perceive, free to openly perceive open intelligence, free to experience when you look again at your own experience right now, what about it is not free? Freely experiencing. There might be unpleasant, not wanted descriptions. <coughs> but if, have a look at the nature of them. See how they naturally release like this line in space. Effortlessly, nothing we needed to do about it. Take the most uncomfortable description you have right now and see how it naturally resolves freely, effortlessly. <clears throat> and so, in my experience, I've been uh, involved in this training for seven or, or eight years and, and more so actually. And what I, what I have seen and come to, to know is this open intelligence is just always on, brightly shining, regardless of what description we have arising. And we utilize all of these data streams, we utilize all of our descriptions to be of benefit in the world. And 
so when we speak about beneficial potency, our, our relationship with beneficial potency and how to come to know beneficial potency is in allowing all data to be as it is, is, is in seeing that we can have all sorts of different <coughs> data going on, be it physical pain, be it anger, be it emotional upset, jealousy, envy. We can have all of these different descriptions going on and in allowing them to be as they are through a simple practice, the only practice you'll hear in the Balance View training to rely on short moments of open intelligence and to repeat that many times. <coughs> in relying on short moments, we allow everything to be as it is, so try it right now. Are you allowing everything to be as it is? Are you doing it good? <laughs> I'm doing it really good. <laughs> Who's not doing it good? <laughs> if you look at your experience, right, there's, there's no way that you, cannot, you can fail at allowing everything to be as it is. So that's how effortlessly free you are right now. That's how instantaneously open you are right now nothing needing to be learnt. This is the education and the nature of mind that I love. <laughs> Not all of these secret books I've got behind here that you have to read before you get for it, before you experience freedom. We don't have, well we have lots of books, but you can experience, <laughs> you can experience that, that directly right now, short moments of open intelligence. <coughs> And every sentence that you may read, that you may hear, it's all whispering to you, allow everything to be as it is. <laughs> all is well, all is perfect. All data are beneficial potency. Your power to be of great, great benefit in the world. Your pow power to be firstly, immediately beneficial to yourself. <coughs> So whatever problems you have got going on now, those ones that you, you need to sort them out before you can be okay. I, I need to make that decision before I can actually relax again. So I'm going to have to wait a few days and then, and then I can do that. All of those kinds of descriptions. See how they effortlessly resolve. You can't hold on to them even if you try. Like the flight path of the bird in the sky, like the line drawn in water, effortlessly, spontaneously releasing. And so this is how naturally powerful we are. We are just coming to recognize our natural innate power, <coughs> our power that is always on, always happening right now, spontaneously, uncontrived, that's a really, really perfect word to, to, in my experience, to look at my experience. Uncontrived joy, happiness, uncontrived spontaneous freedom, uncontrived spontaneous benefit. This uncontrived aspect is what I've always really wanted. I did many, many different techniques, different practices, different uh, doing all sorts of different things and all of my efforts were contriving some kind of, of well-being, some kind of sense of, of relief, some kind of... Uh, basically what I, what I had learnt was that I needed to collect a certain amount of positive data streams, positive thoughts, positive emotions, positive sensations to tick the box of being good, being happy, being, having a good life. And what we start to really see in, in relying on open intelligence and being around the balance view training and, and really uh, getting to know what we call the four mainstays, which is 
basically a support structure that just really empowers your, your beneficial potency. What we see is that we find a, a true and accurate education in the nature of mind, a precise education in the nature of mind where we don't need to wait for those positive data streams anymore. We see again, open intelligence is all pervasive, like light pervades space. So, all pervasive means all, all, all data, all data, bathed equally and evenly in open intelligence potency. And so again, have a look in your own experience. What about you right now is not spontaneously releasing, allowing everything to be as it is, being totally awesome at relying on open intelligence. We're just reminded again and again and again just how innately perfect we are, regardless of what circumstances we have in our own life, regardless of what we are experiencing. And so all of the efforts, the games to, to really collect those positive descriptions that became just totally boring, totally boring and, and dulling of our, our complete power. When we, status streams arise, right? The thoughts, emotions and sensations, they continue. And when we effortlessly allow them to be as they are, without describing them, they have this shine this energy, basic energy of, of benefit. So if I leave all, if I share from my own experience, because that's basically all we, we do here. I share from my own experience how everyday life situations, completely ordinary data, become really extraordinary. Like sitting in front of many, many people. <laughs> feeling all sorts of different things and having that uh, shine and sparkle with benefit. Left undescribed, there's this, there's this awesomeness to, to each and every data stream. And uh, I'll leave Kathy to speak about the rest. And <laughs> but it's exciting to, to work and be involved in Massive Vibe Live, which you've seen somewhat on the video. I'll, we'll fix that up and show it to you again next week. But um, you'll see more and more of this in the coming days because we'll have a, a show here soon. But that's another example of beneficial potency, really, just and seeing in my own experience is just so so complete evidence of not placing open intelligence into a certain state or to a certain way it should look or feel people speaking up <laughs> dancing outrageously singing sharing their their gifts strengths and talents in in ways that i'm sure they've never known that they could do do before either and and that's also my experience as well. Uh, finding ways that we, we see all of these different data streams and we harness them to, to really be of benefit. And so Massive Vibe Live is, yeah, it's, it's a totally exciting project and something I'm completely honoured to, to be involved in and look forward to sharing more and more about.